nine. 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 <gasps> no! I want to order the cat bells. Nope. So welcome to Hollow Cocoon. <laughs> no! Oh bitch! Oh I don't have the password! Y'all. What's the password? Give me the answer now. <laughs> so welcome to Hollow Cocoon. Let's uh, get to it. Uh, shop bonus content. Oh, I think this unlocks after you finish the game the first time. Uh... Running, mouse pad, controller vibration, uh, turn off. The secrets of the diary, that's just. Oh! Now, see, like, I like snakes! But that would, that would scare me. If I'm not, like, expecting it, that would scare the crap out of me. Okay. Select difficulty. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, show me show me a picture. Uh, difficulty does not affect the ending. Oh, I like that. Okay. For people who regularly play games, running only consumes stamina when spotted by an enemy. Selecting items to bring. Okay. For the more experienced gamer, running consumes stamina. Fewer recover items will be available. Enemy abilities and encounter rates are increased. See, I like how they're like... Uh, the more experienced gamers. Like, dude, I've been playing games my whole life. Difficulty level hard does not make you a better gamer. For new or casual gamers. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. How about for people that, you know, just want to have mental sanity? Running will not consume stamina. More recovery items will be available. Enemy abilities and encounter rates are reduced. I, I like that. <laughs> uh, start game. I like that. We also know that I'm gonna be bad at this, cause I I'm horrible at stealth. Minato kun. Minato kun. Jinba. Minato kun. Okite kudasai. Kimi no otosan. Eiji san kara denwa ga haitte imasu yo. The day we never should have answered the phone. もしもし。もしどうぞ。みんなとか。こんな夜更けに電話するなんて。下宿の大家さんに迷惑じゃないか。すまないな。しかし急を要することだ。一体何事なんだよ。キヌさんがお前のおばあさんが倒れたと。診療所から連絡があった。私も仕事で知らせを受けるのが遅れてしまったんだ。詳しい容体はわからない。明日の朝一、お前と私でその診療所へ。何言ってるんだよ。母さんは実の娘の葬式にすら顔を出さなかった人
I'd be like, mm mm, not going. Miyama Kinu san no gokasoku desu ne. Hai. Kino, Niwasaki de taorete iru sugato o haitatsuin ni hakken sare, toin e hakobi komane mashita. Kinu san no yodai ni tsuite desu ga, ishiki ga naku, amari kanbashiku arimasen. Hekichi toyu koto mo ari, toin dewa manzoku na kensa mo dekimasen shi, genjou wa shouko o tamotte imasu ne. そうですか。わかりました。みなと、お前は人を先にキヌさんの家に来て休んでいなさい。鍵を渡しておこう。キヌさんが持っていたものだ。私はキヌさんの店員を済ませてから車でお前を迎えに行くとしよう。The graphics are nice. Ah, Minato, Dana. Kokoma de Game's already like run. You dropped it in an animal fix? Okay. I'm rich! menu screen view items of Minato's current HP. Certain items like like Semagon, which replenishes the stamina HP, can also be used directly from the inventory. Hi. Money, let's go. It's a game where you flick a ten yen coin into the goal. Maybe I'll give it a shot. My money. This is dangerous. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, ah. I got too greedy there. Well, 
That sucks. <laughs> there goes all my money. The sad part is I almost got it on the first shot, too. <sighs> now I'm broke. Hopefully I don't need money to buy things. Feels bad. Oh my god, money! I, I think I officially have a gambling addiction. <laughs> I'm just like, you know, if I go back and I play the game again, maybe I'll get it. This is bad. This area, including Ichinose Village, is planned to be a dam construction site. No, listen, the reason why no one lives here is because they were eaten alive by a creature. Get it right. Um, there is an achievement. I just, I don't remember if the achievement is, like, finish the game, like, like win, or, like, play it, like, a million times. Because I think your stats for the game carry over. I could be wrong. I, I remember watching somebody play the game. And they were trying for the achievement, but, like, I don't know if they ended up ever getting it or not. Don't destroy our town. I'm assuming that's, that's probably Grandma's house. And I mean, we did play the demo. Miyama Family Grave. Grandpa Saichi. Ooh! 10 yen times 4! Dude, you shouldn't be taking money from the dead. Nothing good's gonna come out of that. I have 7 now. Wait, when, when did I get this key? Wait a minute. Uh... You do not own a map yet. So there's a total of 42 files. Wait, you guys see that, right? You see that, that naked creature thing near the temple? Did you see it? I'm not crazy, right? She went behind that red pillar? Can I go? Hey. Notice how I'm trying to just like totally avoid going to the house. <laughs> I'm just like, mm. look how beautiful this is. The sunlight peeking through the trees. I love that effect. This is like the ideal horror game scenario without nighttime, you know? It's beautiful. It's still creepy. Hmm. It should just stay like that. Miyama. Sousan <laughs>
Start from a checkpoint, load game setting for Zoom. Bonus content. Letter from the village mayor. Dear Kinu Miyama, I have recently been approached by Town Hall. They have requested that I, as the mayor, intervene and persuade you to comply with the eviction notice issued for the dam construction. I understand how truly heartbreaking it is, or it must be, to have to leave the land that your ancestors had protected for generations. However, it must be acknowledged that both I and the villagers have very reluctantly accepted this project out of necessity. Considering the prosperity of the Miyama family silkworm business, I am confident that your silkworms will continue to prosper in any new location. Perhaps it is time for you to contemplate a fresh start as well. Between us, rumor has it that whenever substantial amounts of money are involved, ill intentions come with it. It would be wise for you to make your decision quickly. Sincerely, the mayor. Make the loudest noises of walking in the woods a name mostly because the leaves are taller than them. You get used to it. It's still creepy, though. Like, even if you get used to it, like, it's still... eerie. Flashlight? <laughs> you think I'm gonna remember where that flashlight is? Oh, game, you're funny. <gasps> okay, I can't jump. Like, I normally don't watch other people play these types of games before we get to play it, because of spoilers and whatever, right? Even though the game's gonna terrify me anyway. But this one, I wasn't sure when we were gonna get to play it, so I kind of watched a playthrough, and I got to see some, like, really weird things, and I'm like, I wonder if we'll manage to get this to happen for us, or... <laughs> or not like you know when examining specific objects your inventory will be shown by selecting the key from the list certain actions may be performed you such as unlocking a door <sighs> oh these are cute Oh, these are cute. I want this. No, no resting, dude. No resting in this house. No need to switch it on? I highly recommend you switch it on. Because why not? No, we're not calling anybody. I have nobody to call currently. Painkillers. Order some Samagon. Write the number down and keep it under the telephone table. I okay. Oh. I'm like yes, healing. There's a flashlight. You know it's sad when the game tells you there's a flashlight, but they don't let you take it ahead of time. Miyama Family Crest. Oh, okay. Which means I'm gonna have to remember where that is later, which I don't like. <laughs> Money! Oh, hello. To my awesome grandpa Saichi. Hi there, how are you? I hope you are super good. I'm a big boy in elementary school now. I go to school every day to learn cool stuff like reading and math. It is fun, but sometimes hard to. I have a really big favor to ask you, grandpa. Could you please buy me a bug collection kit? Mom won't buy me one. She says bugs are not toys and we should not catch them or hurt them. All my friends have one and I'm left out. Oh, and grandpa, when are you coming to my house again? I have never met grandma and I really want her to come with you. It would be so much fun. You know, I, I feel a little bit sad when you have to leave. I ask mom every day when you will come back. She says you live far away so we can't see each other a lot. But I really can't wait to see you again. Please write soon. Minato. Grandpa never wrote back? Well, that's sad. Was missing the shift to run any high-tech slayer to make you further paranoid? 
Oh, for sure, for sure. But I think the reason why they didn't add those features in was so they didn't confuse people and, like, people thinking that it's there. It's an altar. A few right of lockers, right? Well, I mean, there was that one room that had lockers in it that made you kind of go, should I? Can I? さいちじいちゃんは井戸に落ちて死んだ。物知りで優しい。いいじいちゃんなんだ。絹さんはじいちゃんが俺たち家族と親しいことを知っていたのに亡くなったことを娘の母さんにさえ知らせなかった。じい
chicken house. Oh, that's not good. Oh no, chicken buddies! Do you not seem phased that there's dead chickens everywhere, dude? He's like, there's a poker and dead chickens. Then take the poker! What is wrong with you? Ah, it's this type of game. You see the heavy climbing under Basil Hut. Right? Oh, oh, I almost had it. And I win! Winning ticket yellow. A winning ticket from the 10 yen games shared between save files. Okay. I win! What, what do I do? Okay. <laughs> They're like, congratulations, you have a winning ticket. But you can't do anything with it. What do I do with it? What's it for? I won. Okay, notice I'll find Ace's Switch Carnival Game Collection. <laughs> okay, let's do. Ah, no, 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 my money. Okay. One more time. Hey! Okay, I'm not wasting my tokens. I won two times. Go me! Here we go. See, he's gambling again. <laughs> I think I've already spent like 20 yen, maybe, maybe more. But I won two times. Honestly, I don't even know how many times you're supposed to win for the achievement. But that's okay. I'm totally not avoiding, you know, proceeding with the game, okay? It's not that I have a gambling addiction. Twitch, Twitch, Twitch. <laughs> okay, listen. I'm not scared, you're scared. Okay. And the fuck goes, I want, I'm beginning to see a pattern. Well, see, gambling, I'm only like this in games. IRL, the gamble, the gamble Funko boxes. I don't gamble with money very often. But I can't get enough of the, the Funko gamble boxes, though. They're too fun. <laughs> I'm not gambling, you are. Exactly! More money. See, the game just keeps wanting me to gamble. They're like, touch this. Do it. Dude, Grandma was rich. Look at this. Who just leaves money lying around? There's something in the drain. Okay. So now can I get said poking stick? Now will you let me do it? Or are you gonna be like, no. You don't need the poking stick until later. We find that the Leola tickets are required to destroy ghosts. It wouldn't surprise me. We want to twist and chat to say that that's a good point. You get a bunch of machines still and you only got this much money in total and you'll have to play them all for the achievement. Yeah, do I have to win on all of them? Or just play e each machine? Because it carries over in them. Um, between playthroughs. Okay, so I can't grab Poking Stick yet. 
This game's evil. I know what I gotta do and they won't let me do it. More to fit in the fridge? Good point. Hey, game. Come on. I know what I gotta do. Yeah. I mean, this is also assuming that you're gonna be playing, like, multiple playthroughs, right? Then, yeah. It carries over. You with the hope of safety and this not out. Exactly. Listen, it's safe to say the game scammed me. Dear Dad, how are you doing? The other day, my husband, IG, and I attended Minato's entrance ceremony under the warm su spring sunshine. Watching him walk with that big backpack, I couldn't help but feel proud of our son. IG was teasing Minato, saying he looks like a giant backpack with legs, to which I couldn't help but smile, too. He was always made us laugh with his jokes. As for me, I'm still the same as always. I feel a little better after drinking water. I still can't bring myself to tell IG about my situation and it tugs at my heart. I wonder how long I can keep this secret. I've spent many sleepless nights worrying, afraid of what'll happen if he finds out. How's mom doing, by the way? There are times when Minato begs me to see his grandma and I struggle to find the right words to say. I don't think she'll be very happy if we come see her. Why does mom dislike me so much? It breaks my heart to think that the rest of my family is being shunned because of me. If only I had the courage to confront mom about this. I'm sorry for constantly venting to you. I know I shouldn't worry you. But I'm a coward who quickly relies on her father. Whenever I hear your voice or read your letters, it gives me peace of mind. I'll write again soon. Please take care of yourself and stay safe. Which you'll do, right? Right now? Because I don't think I can 100% clear the game. Because isn't, like, isn't there an achievement for beating the game on the hardest difficulty? I think. And it's like, mm -mm. Hell no. Do I want to rest? I don't think I want to rest. I don't want to. Resting is bad. We don't want to do that. Rest until nighttime. No, nighttime is bad! Okay. Now, unless the items that you unlock allow you to, like, one-shot the ghost instantly. <laughs> That would make me close my eyes. Okaiko Samadi. Okaiko Samadi. So they were dying, 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 あとえまよでられても、もう口はないし、飛ぶこともできない。卵を産んで死んでしまう。人がそういう虫にしてしまった。Oh, those are pretty. <coughs> But you know we're not gonna do that. Like, no. Spirit gone. 
I don't know how I didn't scream at that one. But my eyes are watering like crazy. Wow. I think it's like one of those moments where it's like you're so creeped out, just nothing comes out. You're just like Tokyo03XXXYYY. But you didn't tell me the number! You just said XXXYYY. Cat Gathering Bell. I want this! Even the tiger! <laughs> Oh, two for the price of one. Ah. Aliens? I'm busy! I gotta go dial that phone number. Leave me alone. Game, you can just stop bothering me for a minute. I have to go order cat gathering bells. I love my grandpa. Oh, that's cute. Oh, I still can't have the flashlight? Okay, okay. It's time! Maybe. Oh, how do I translate it? Zero, three, what would be X, 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 Y, Y, Y on a telephone? Call 911. Oh, I have no coffee left. <clears throat> you don't know? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to Google this? So. Nine, 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 nine. Sad.
Those red cute flowers, the red spider lilies, and they symbolize death. <gasps> oh wow! See, I I love lilies. My favorite my favorite ones are the tiger lilies. Oh, somebody left me a chicken head at my door. That's definitely not a cat, Bell. Did a weasel get in? That's seriously the question you're asking me right about now? A weasel? Mushy mushy. Mushy mushy. Minato, what is that? Nanda, Tosanka. Ima doko, Nanji go to Nitske. So no cotton and Nanda, wow, Kaira so monai. Ima, ten sakino in Karakate Irundana. Do you know what I'm talking about? The police. The police? Why are they talking about the police? まだ相当決まったわけじゃないが。用心するに越したことはないだろう。ミナト。一人で大丈夫か。No, <笑> I would just be like, listen. No. I'm not okay. Get me out of here. He's like, it's too dark. I can't drink water in the dark. This one has orange and white, but both of them. Ah. Imagine if they were actually able to ship real ones. Jeez. Probably not, they'd be, probably be dead before they even get there. Dude, this is where you just want to just run away. Leave. Leave while you can. Don't go there. Don't do this. You're not very smart. It was nothing or everything's fine. No, my chicken! Right? 
Minato cannot defend himself. It is crucial to avoid detection at all costs. Running is faster than walking, though be wary that it consumes stamina on some difficulties. If Minato runs out of stamina, he will be unable to run for a period of time. While crouching, Minato gets into a lower position, reducing the sound of footsteps while moving, making it harder for enemies to hear him. If an enemy finds Minato, Minato must run and hide. Minato can enter some places such as closets to hide from enemies. A special icon will indicate objects that Minato can hide in. That's true, the chickens didn't listen. Use lean or li look back to check your surroundings. However, using the flashlight will make it more likely that you are detected by the enemies. Sometimes it is better to just turn it off. It's in the house with me. Wait, what was I supposed to do? I'm fine, everything's fine. I make a phone call, right? We got the flashlight. I could offer it more chickens. I have a chicken egg. Oh, I didn't know I could do that. Oh, it's so creepy. Help me! Oh my god, she's not. Oh! Oh, she's angry. Oh, she's choking me out. She just choke slammed me. Ma'am? Can you. I got the heart attack. Did I say you can use the phone? I scared you so bad. <laughs> 
気分が悪くなると嫌がっていたそれこそ異常なくらいになんだろうこの札を見ていると頭が痛くなってくる The r e t a s m e n t of the wall is a save point save progress at save points Poking stick. Because, <laughs> you know, a poking stick is so good. Now I'm just like, what am I supposed to do? Listen, logically, when they're like, ah,、oh, Minato can't defend himself, and I'm like, yo, listen, I got a fucking poking stick. I'm pretty sure it can help me a little bit. It probably won't be able to kill whatever the hell that thing is, but you know, it should probably help me a little bit. Or just, you know, make it extremely angry. Both seem equally possible. I still feel safer with the poking stick. Except now we don't have the poking stick. But we got a dresser key. So the only reason why I'm saving again is just in case I die. I don't want to have to like re remember to go find that key. You know what's sad? I thought, you know, it's not supposed to notice you as much when you're, you know, crouching and on easy mode. And it's like, it's gonna be it's finding me. Hey! Thank you so much! I appreciate that. I think I, I know where the box thing is that I need. It's, you know, right near the broken phone. And. shit. Why do you have to close the door? Just keep it open. Pencil. Oh, it broke the thing. Great, thanks, game. Now you tell me that I need a pencil. Well, actually, no, you're not really telling me I need a pencil. Hello.
I'm just gonna, um, hide again. <laughs> Canada has lily farms in every province all around the southern borough. Really? That's actually kind of funny. Okay, so the game is not telling me what I need. Which is kind of confusing. Okay, dresser key. Okay, so it's not what I was thinking. I thought this was the dresser under the telephone that obviously is broken now. So that means there's another dresser somewhere in this house that I need to find without getting murdered. Dude, dude, it's not time to get that excited over an egg. It's dark and I don't know where I'm going. Here are a bunch of keys, good luck. Totally makes sense though. Okay, we're gonna read this in a in a Okay, so we did checkpoint, we got the pencil now. It's old lady knick-knacky, but it's cool looking. The crystal petals come in prismatic, clear, red, blue, pink, and purple. Ooh. I think they'd all be pretty, pretty on the colors, though, eh? Potentially. Okay, so we got the pencil. And the game, the game did technically checkpoint. I didn't even see this room earlier. Can we circle? Oh, I don't have the password. <laughs> Listen, this is the moment where I'm like, y'all, what's the password? Give me the answer now. <laughs> Cause she's right behind me. <laughs> if I try to get back to that notepad, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Are the puzzles randomly generated? Oh, God. <clears throat> okay, let's see. Nine, six, seven.
Is it really randomly generated? Open. Nine, six, seven. <gasps> oh no. Game's like, you can't cheese it. Now you have no choice but to go. That's from a walkthrough? Fuck. Okay. It just sucks because there's no way out of this hallway. Unless she already left. Dude, you're breathing too loud. Stop that. Those flowers were really pretty. I can't even say like which color was the prettiest because they all looked really nice. Of course. Seven, two, three, two. It's like taking everything I have not to like take off running. And I know that I know the game is dark. I'm too scared to turn on the flashlight. Thank you. Oh my god, she's coming! chicken. We're totally out of chicken. Oh, this is a pretty room. Are you gone? We just stay here forever and ever and ever. Butterflies. Oh. Butterflies are pretty. Thank you for your letter. Kino and I are doing just fine. So Minato has entered elementary school, okay? My how time flies. It 
feels like just yesterday he was a baby. I can't help but think maybe it's because I'm getting older more than anything. How close you are to, to your family warms my heart. Oops. When you're thirsty, remember what I told you. Try not to hold it. This burden is not your fault after all. You feel guilty for keeping something hidden from IG, but you're afraid of telling him also. IG is a kind man. Otherwise, I would never have given him my blessing. Whenever you're ready to tell him, I'm sure IG will accept you for who you are. For years, you've been worried about that Kinu doesn't like you. Kinu doesn't attend your wedding and didn't care when she became a grandma, but Kinu is like this with everyone, including me. She never leaves that house under any circumstance. It may be difficult for you to understand, but Kinu could never be a good mother or grandmother. That's why I took you out of her house and moved us into town. I still feel guilty for giving you that feeling of emptiness from lack from a lacking mother, despite having one. I'm not asking you to forgive Kinu for her behavior, but I want you to understand that Kinu has her own reasons. I'm so happy when IG asked me to leave Kinu and come live with you three. It brought a tear to my eye. Thanks to him, I was able to return to the Miyama house where Kinu is with a clear conscience. Now you have IG and Minato, there's no need for me to be by your side. I've left Kinu alone for a long time. She's a strong woman, but as she grows older, I want to give her my support. Remember this well, Yul. You're my pride and joy. Whenever you're in trouble or feeling anxious, you can always rely on me. See yourself in the room in a haunted house that has bad luck shut, right? <laughs> But, I mean, at least it separates me from me and, you know, her. Right, right. I honestly, I just realized that door was open. It's like, oh, okay, suddenly now I don't feel safe. <laughs> Mrs. Kinu. I'm ready to inform you about the results of your examination at our clinic. Based on the diagnose, diagnostic images ex obtained from the x-ray, we have identified an abnormality in your cranial region that it appears to be a brain tumor. Symptoms you have been experiencing, such as your headaches and severe forgetfulness, are likely related to this tumor. It is important to address this condition promptly. The tumor requires quick and immediate treatment. It is important to know that your memory may continue to deteriorate, and the painkillers you have been taking will only provide limited relief. I strongly advise you to discuss this matter with your family and make arrangements to visit our clinic as soon as possible. The door being open to crack is creepy. Big ass storage shed. Well, I don't like this room. <laughs> Dear Kinu, I hope this letter finds you all. This is IG. It has been because of the time since the untimely passing of my beloved wife, Yui. Oh, Yui! I thought I said Yul. Today I'm reaching out to you with a few inquiries regarding my son, Minato, who is now 13. Minato started attending middle school this year, and I want to share something I've noticed with you. Since summer, he's been getting unusually thirsty and consumes a substantial amount of water. Initially, I thought it was the hot weather and didn't think much of it. However, as autumn passed and winter came, he was still constantly thirsty, prompting me to seek medical advice. However, the doctor found nothing wrong with him. Thinking back, I recall that Yui also had a tendency to drink a lot of water. Before her passing, I had discussed it with her, but she mentioned this was something she inherited from her father. She assured me that there was no need to worry. I'm curious to know if your husband mentioned anything about this predisposition. If you have any knowledge regarding this matter, I would greatly appreciate your answer. <laughs>
Dude, this place is so creepy. So hard. Definitely, definitely. addiction it's safer I want to see something actually settings uh, now if I go full full gamma that's actually not bad it's still dark but we can maneuver without the flashlight if we need to Summer, spring. The legendary Princess Mayu. Once upon a time, there lived a princess named Mayu, adorned with beauty untold. Beneath the spring's moon glow, Princess Mayu's sister, consumed by envy's woe, led her to a fearsome fountain where lions roamed free. Lions. Leaving her stranded a perilous decree, yet to her surprise, Princess Mayu returned home, her spirit unbroken and her body whole. As the summer moon shimmered above, Princess Mayu's sister, driven by Envy's love, guided her to a shower, shadowy mountain steep where hawks flocked, secrets to keep. But again, the Princess Mayu defied her fate, returning unscathed through Destiny's Gate. With autumn moon shining bright. Okay, so the boot. The boot. The boat goes on autumn. Winter's garden. <laughs> <laughs> That's not nice. It just gave me a brain cramp again. <laughs> okay, wait. Remove the boat. Okay. Summer, spring, 
Autumn. Wait, I gotta go back to the poem again. <laughs> Lion is spring, summer is hawk. Oh wait. Remove, wait, I just completely screwed that one up, right? Lion is spring, summer is hawk. Was autumn? Autumn was boat, right? Winter was garden and autumn was boat. Okay, so the boat was already in the right spot. Oh. Boat. Spring lion summer. Oh, it's all good. See, things like this are not too bad at figuring out, right? So it's, it's more like the other tricky ones that, you know, involve like codes and math puzzles and things where it's like, oh dude, this is gonna be hard. So even with full gamma, this place is really dark. When I vote in. Lord Keel Bay, please forgive me. I have seen nothing. I have told no one. My lips shall remain sealed. I promise to serve the Miyama family forever and ever, so please let me leave this place. I, too, am a human being. Please do not use my flesh as a meal for that creature. Just type it and look I took an earphone to take the call. Please make a hair you <laughs> Silkworm Records. The Miyama family's livelihood through generations revolved around safeguarding the silkworms and selling their eggs. One second. Oh my god, my mouse. <clears throat> okay. Uh, Miyama silkworm's threads possess a remarkable combination of luster and flexibility. The exceptionally beautiful silkworms. True. Thanks to heaven's enjoyed prosperity, legend has it that Miyama silkworms originated from silkworms from sprouting from the body of Princess Bayou. Oh, oh, oh. These silkworms have been cherished and revered as family heirlooms. The female silkworm moth serves as the crest of the Miyama family.
ここからかすかに風の流れを感じるこの壁もしかして隠し扉になってるのかな I mean, I don't like the idea of proceeding. Talisman. The red talisman is a protective charm used in the region from ancient times. It is made by dyeing paper with a crimson color believed to repel demons and drawing symbolic characters in black ink. The exact meaning of the symbols is unknown. It is speculated that they represent the sun deity, as sunlight is believed to purify their negative energies. According to the village legend, when a demon approaches the talisman, it immediately emits a radiant light, torturing the demon as it is exercised. <laughs> It's a creepy place. Okay, so we finally have a map. Loki, stop it. That's it. That's it. Give me a minute. He's going to actual jail. Okay, so we're in the Eastern Tatami room. There's a toilet. A well. Northern Tatami room. So downstairs here is really big, eh? Current floor. Servant room, closet, closet. So these are like hiding spots, I'm assuming. Kitchen? If I lower my priorities? No, there's still not time. Uh, okay, so where did we come from? I think we came from here, eh? Yeah, the storage shed. This way. So I gotta go through this door and then head this way. Lovely. Uh, 
have we'll we'll read this later. Oh, the game's really good. Outside of, you know, the whole stealth and, you know, being chased by things. She really is. Like, she needs to calm down. I was finally... Sort of where I wanted to be. <laughs> you know what makes it scary is the not knowing where the hell she went. Because she didn't follow me. things that, like I don't like about these types of games like especially like when you jump into a hiding spot if the if the creature is within the vicinity they, they know you're there right they, they can pull you out it's the fact that it's like you have to run you have to backtrack so far just to get away a bucket? Okay, the shrine... This place is huge.
But the way it moves actually freaks me out. The the ghost model is pretty nice. I like the fact that it's like it's something relatively newish. Not like a copy and paste asset that a lot of games use. Okay, so there's some stairs here if I go through this door here. And then another door here that can go into this section. Crowbar closet, baths, toilet. Oh, that's literally why it's called crowbar toilet. Oh, okay. Now I get it. It makes sense why it's called crowbar toilet. Something stuck on the other side. The screws are gone rusty, the door won't open. I think we can totally fit through this door. Okay, wait. Okay, so for now... Okay, so we're in the Titani room. Okay, so through the door is the silk room door. And there's another door there. Okay. Uh, okay, so we stopped... I've been fortunate enough to have been accepted as the son-in-law of the Miami family. My father and brother have always looked down on me, considering my, me weak and spineless. However, in the eyes of Lord Kyube, I am the loyal trust of the men. We have exchanged vows and I have eagerly await the joyful ceremony next spring. Ever since I laid eyes on her, Ayano's figure has been etched in my mind. Her skin lightly glowing and her sleek, shiny black hair. She often averts her gaze, but even the shadow cast by her long eyelashes on her cheeks is beautiful. I couldn't, my shoulders would roll when you walk through the door. <laughs> Once to get Ayano's attention by any means necessarily, so I decided to show her my collection of butterfly samples. I hope that the colorful butterflies butterflies would bring her joy. Ayana said, I've never seen such beautiful butterflies before, but her expression was that of melancholy. When I asked her if she disliked butterflies, she replied, I like butterflies, however, I don't like seeing them trapped and confined. I just want to watch them fly in their natural state. Her words stuck me, struck me to my core. It has been several months since Dad passed away. Not a day goes by without a box of tissues by my side. When I came to offer my condolences, I couldn't come to terms with Dad's death. I couldn't even speak with you, Mom. Why didn't you tell us right away? You didn't even invite our family to the funeral. If we hadn't reached out, you wouldn't have bothered to tell us at all. Dad was an important role model for me. I wanted to give him a final farewell. 
I was weak and always hid behind Dad. I was scared to talk to you, Mom. I feared you'd say I hate you, but now that Dad is gone, I can't go on like this anymore. I need to speak with you in person, Mom. There's something I must ask you. On September 21st, I will come alone without telling Ig or Minato. I don't expect a response to this letter. I've written to you many times before, Mom. Mom. And if you've never replied, I've, I've been waiting for a long time. I'll see you on the 21st. Could be, could be, yeah. It, that would make more sense. I was chatting with Saichi, waiting for my sister to get ready. He, he gave me a pearl hairpin, saying that I would match with my sister and her hairpin. I heard neither you nor Ayana had ever laid eyes on the sea, he said. I thought the two of you would appreciate something from there. Considering how close the two of you are, I would be delighted to, if you would wear them together. As he handed me the hairpin, my face instantly flushed. I wondered if he could hear my racing heart and if my excitement was too obvious. I had to hide my face. It was the first time a man other than my father had given me a gift. Unlike my stern father, his voice was gentle and soft. I wished to have that voice by my side forever. And then he whispered into my ear, Isn't Iona like a butterfly? With that, the blush from my cheeks was extinguished. The pounding of my chest subsided, as if my very pulse had stopped. He tendered the caress the other hairpin intended for my sister, reminding me of whom his heart belonged to. Indeed, my sister Ayano is like a butterfly. She loves being carried away by the wind and drenched by the rain. Touching her delicate wings would only result in pain. Iona is beautiful, delicate, and fragile. I could crush her with my bare hands. For now, I am still the only one who can be with her. I am the only one who can place my hand upon that slender white neck. I am the only one. Well. <clears throat> Cause you know that's not. Right? Uh, that'll exit. So, well. Okay, so we need something to also remove. The boards. Be quiet, she's like right there. Oh, I don't like this. Kitchen. When I visited the Miyama family, I caught a glimpse of Ayano and Kinu walking together in the front yard. Ayano had an innocent girlish smile on her face as she talked to Kinu, but as soon as she noticed me, her smile disappeared. I had a faint suspicion all along whom she had eyes for, whose side she wishes to be by, and it's not me.
考えるのはやめておこう。あ、oh,、the crowbar key、okay。これが何かは考えたくない。Oh my god. Wow, she literally walked right past me. Okay. I said, I want to go in this room here. Right? Oh my god. I'm pretty sure. Crowbar closet might probably give me the item that I'm gonna need to break the floorboards. I think is in this room. That or it's gonna give me the bucket that I need for this. Oh, but I wanna go into this room. But she opened the door in front of me, which I didn't know that door opened. YOLO for content. I mean, we, we,、uh, we did hit a checkpoint. Ah! What happened? Oh, she's right in front of me. Oh, fuck, fuck. Damn it. Okay, yeah, there, there's your YOLO. She's this. Mayday! Mayday! That doesn't open! No! Oh, oh, God, oh, God. What's that? What happened there? Oh, oh, oh I found a door! Oh, ma'am. That's not nice. I honestly, I legit don't know where I am. Oh, that's a dead end. Ah! Ah! Oh, I probably should have hid there. Oh, I screwed up. Are you still chasing me? You're totally chasing me. Ma'am? Right? And what do I do? I duck into the stall that doesn't have a door. <laughs> like, there's no door here. <laughs> oh, thank you. I honestly forgot that we took in damage. Well. Oh, see, see, see? This is what I mean. That having to backtrack so far because of the running? Because now I'm like, oh, oh. I guess the only good part is if I can get back across this way, I can go to the crowbar closet. So we still didn't find the thing that I need for that, the well yet. You know, the, the funny thing is, right? When you said go like YOLO, right? It's like, okay, fine. I'm going to go to that door. You know, I got this. I didn't realize that when I stepped out from behind the kitchen counter thing, she was like right there. <laughs> so it's like, there wasn't much for YOLOing. I just legit didn't even see her standing there. I was like, oh, that sucks. <laughs> I mean, it kind of worked out good, but like, also, like, ah,、oh, shit. That was totally not what I wanted. Okay, now. Okay, I gotta go straight and then up. Just so I can open up this door. You know. 
know. Just a little bit. Mr. Kilby, during our business negotiations, the plate that I had to look at was remarkable. At first glance, it may appear somewhat in uninspiring to the eyes of a novice like myself, but I never dreamed that it would ha have such an intricate mechanism. Only when immersed in cold, clear water does the truly beauty of the artwork reveal itself, and I'm truly impressed. I hope to have the opportunity to see it again in the future. Okay, so I was right. Okay, so crowbar closet. Now, um, okay. So assuming she doesn't come running at me, we go down uh, through here, back here, this one here, then this way, and then... I believe the nails are the nail thing is in here, I think. I think. But if I can get to here, I can see what's in this room. Well, assuming. Also, I do apologize for not using um, the flashlight more. Just obviously, ideally, this to me works out better. Well, sort of. <laughs> Wait. Did I not enter the servant room then? Oh. I didn't even realize. We're just gonna close this door for a minute. Did you? Perfect. <laughs> That's not what you want? Oh, that's just like a free spin? Ah. Ah, oh, okay, I get it. Are they? Maybe YouTube's having issues? Oh, this one's- this one's hard. Ah. Shit. Yeah, free spin should allow you to freaking. Oh my god. You know it. I gotta fuel my- my addiction somehow. Hey, shit. Perfect, thank you. Okay, so earlier I didn't even realize that we had like a little bit of a safe zone here. Okay. So it wasn't! So this wasn't the room that I was thinking.
Uh, what should I do? I've gone and lost the key. I hid, I had it with me before I went to the toilets, but somehow I managed to lose it. If anyone finds, I'll be doomed. Low QA will show no mercy. A lost key? Okay, I know where I am now. Okay, okay, okay. I don't know where she is. Oh, she's here. Or she was here. She might be stuck on the door. Oh no, she's over there now. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so... Awesome. Maybe then the tata maybe the the um, was it the northern tatami room maybe that I needed the thing. Oh. So I thought maybe I thought it was here, but I can't enter this room yet. Yet. Or did I? I don't know. Right, so she's she's circling, eh? Okay. Okay, so because we got caught earlier, I don't know if these doors are locked. Yet. Right now. So she went this way, which means so she's probably in this hallway now. Which means she's probably here at the moment. Right, yeah, because if she cuts through the kitchen, it's the only way to get through. So the best way is to wait for her to go through this way again. So when she goes this way... Yeah. Yeah, when she goes here... I can... Go here... And pray that the door is not locked. Well... All I can do is pray. Because <laughs> the closet here, though, is the safe zone with the talisman. Now, I don't know what happens if she hits the talisman. I don't think she dies, but she might be, like, temporarily stunned or something. I also don't hear her. Oh, I don't like that. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I hear her now. So let's see if I'm right. Okay, she's okay. She just passed the kitchen. Okay, so she's in front of there. Okay, so the problem is she's heading into that same direction. So I would have to circle... Kind of the same way she's going. Oh, shit. Ew! She went upstairs. Oh, I was not expecting that. Okay. 
Okay, that is not right. Okay, okay. Okay, so then if I can run... Okay, so these two doors are locked, so I can YOLO back to the closet. Someone said so dibs on the monkey things that oh you're not getting my mug. <laughs> the same point of talisman can repel evil spirits and repel enemies who get close. However, each time the talisman repels an enemy, it consumes magic. When the magic is depleted, the talisman's color fades and it loses its effects. You can still save out of faded talisman. The number of times a talisman can repel an enemy depends on the difficulty. Ah, okay, 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 cool. Okay, so we repelled her. Now, I don't know what direction she ran in. Okay, it's not the shrine that I wanted. That's not the room either. My issue. I'm starting to think the nail the nails were in the eastern tatami room. Because we just checked the shrine, we just checked the northern room, it wasn't there. So I think I gotta go back across here and then go to the eastern room. Now I just gotta Okay. So the issue with repelling her, I'm not sure how long it repels her for. Was this the room? Okay, we have an issue. We have a problem now. Okay, I'm just gonna go hide here. I don't know now what room it was in. I thought it was this room, but it's not. And it's not this room. Ah, oh, shit. It was the silkworm room? So... but this takes me back to the storage shed. I don't think it's that far back, right? So according to this, Butterfly Closet Silk Room Tatami is second floor. Oh, here. Ah, oh, here, here, here. Oh, here. Okay. open 
this door. Yeah, I can't go here. Oh, wait, where's the stairs? Wait a minute. Oh, fuck. There we go. Thank you. See, this is why flashlights are very important. <laughs> I was like, I couldn't see the stairs. I'm like, this door is locked. Like... The peony key. I've started being mean to Ayano. I intentionally avoid talking to her and I'm being unfriendly towards her. I love Saichi too much to not do this. No matter what I do, she never asks me why. Instead, on the verge of tears, she says, I'm sorry, Kino, please forgive me, even though she has nothing to apologize for. Today is an autumn dusk. My sister and I ventured into the mountains from the path to the shrine to admire the colorful autumn foliage. I held my sister's hand tightly. She smiled with joy and squeezed my hand in return. She didn't hold my recent behavior against me. She had always been kind to me. Ever since we were children, we would sneak out during autumn. Together we would watch the leaves turn crimson and the sunset paint the sky. As the chilly winds of late autumn blew, I could feel the warmth of our joined hands. But this will probably be the last time. Next spring, my sister will marry Saiji, while I will be married off to someone else. Kinu, the maple trees are beautiful. Let's do this again next year. My sister says this with innocent eyes. She torments me out of the turmoil in my heart. The sister who has always been with me is slipping away. I couldn't put into words the horrific things I felt. Finally, I unleashed my frustration and revealed everything to her. I will never go again. Why don't you go with Saiji instead? You, you don't need me anymore after all. I said those words forcefully, releasing her hand and walked away. I turned my back on her and kept walking, not wanting her to see the tears streaming down my face. From behind me, a faint voice whispered, don't leave me. Pretending not to hear, I continued walking down the mountain alone. At that moment, I wondered if my sister Ayana was also shedding tears. Hello. Oh! Oh! That's not nice! Ah! Oh shit! The door! The door's stuck! You stupid spider bitch! I'm lost again! <gasps> oh, I'm so gonna die. Oh, I'm so gonna die. I'm so lost. Someone save me. Save me from this misery. You're not allowed to be that fast. Oh, I'm going way too far. My soul is gone. You know the thing is, I should have realized that she probably would come through the floor, but I'm just like, oh no, it's just gonna be one of those cheap jump scares. She's just gonna look at me. And now, once again, I'm a million miles away from where I wanted to be. <laughs> Thank you. Well, actually, no, that's. Oh, yeah. No, I'm still a million miles away. I did unlock a door, but the problem is I don't know what door I unlocked. <laughs> she peeked, she looked, and she attacked right. I wasn't expecting her to attack, which is like my own fault there. Okay. Well, let's head back. Oh gosh, she's right there. Now she's just cheating. Now she's like spawn camping. Yeah, I know, I'm trying to get her to like... What?!
I'm still good. I just don't know how far she goes when repelled. And for how long she stays away for. Is this the door? That's not the door that I unlocked. Okay. So I still can't go here yet. Okay, so... Denied. Okay, so I think that's the door I unlocked. Was this one here. When she came at me. Yeah, there's the floor. Okay, okay, okay. So, okay, we're back in... There's a hiding spot here. Ah, okay, so we dropped down into the servant's room. Okay, okay. So, peony room should be these ones down here. Wait, where am I going? No, wrong way. I'm just saving again. Okay. And it should be... Yay. Okay. Oh, this one's counting rods on the lock. Okay, okay, okay. We'll read this in a minute. Sister Ayano behind and descended the mountain alone. Not certain she would follow me. I anticipated her tearful apology as she had done countless times before, but Ayano never returned. Why did I let her go of, of her hand? If only we had gone down the mountain together, hand in hand, Ayano would still be by my side. I lost her due to my shallow jealousy. I cried and lived in sorrow for days, and now I've run out of tears. I heard someone calling my name on a snowy night, so I looked outside. To my surprise, Ayano was standing in front of the gate. She had been wandering the mountain for a month, yet her kimono, sandals, and hair remained pristine and spotless. However, she had lost her ability to speak. If she couldn't talk, how was she calling your name? I embraced her tightly, clutching her hand as tears streamed down my face. Ayana's hand was warm, the warmth I had once let slip away. I will never let it go again. Okay. So. Courtyard. Door, door, entrance. We don't know yet what's over here multiple doors here. Ooh, if lucky we might be able to unlock this door for a shortcut. Maybe. in front of my face. I 
I did it again. I was not expecting her to jump in front of my face in the freaking courtyard. Like, the good part, at least somehow in my chaos of running around in a circle, I ended up back in the location that I wanted to be. So, so it kind of worked out good. digging okay okay now I'm gonna assume we're gonna dig something here okay so when I ran the other way then Counting rod. Yeah, oh yeah, this one we didn't open. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, is that the bucket? You know one thing that I really do appreciate about the game? Like, outside of being chased, like, a bajillion times? Hmm. Is that at least the game checkpoints after you pick up an item. Okay, so I know at least where we gotta do the bucket. That part I know where to go. Now. Oh! Okay, so this was the door we unlocked. Okay, okay. And this is where I accidentally ran and got sandwiched. Or not, no. Oh, it's another save point. Oil can. Oh, maybe for some of the other doors that didn't want to open. This is the moment where I'm like, game, can you tell me which doors that was? <laughs> okay, so we can go through the bath and go check the toilet room over here. Ah, 
Oh, okay, this is the room that I ran in when trying to get away from her. Let me just go stand here for a second here. <gasps> a sandwich would be so good. Okay. Oh. Ouch. Okay, so we know we've we've got the bucket for the well. We've got that. And then we've got the counting rod closet key, which is over here. I've received news of Iona's return, yet I haven't been able to meet her since she first went missing. Despite my repeated request to visit her, Lord Kyobe only responds with Iona is unwell. In the midst of it, in my dark and gloomy days, I was suddenly summoned to the Miyama residence. Lord Kyobe stared at me with a grim expression. Iona is afflicted with a severe illness. If you want to see her, you must marry Kido and become part of the Miyama family, he demanded. If you change your mind after, you will not survive. As long as I can be with Iona, I don't care what happens to me. Without hesitation, I accepted his request. Iona was in the depths of a dark cave, trapped in a dungeon. She was almost unrecognizable. The woman I had fallen for was no longer there. To be honest, she seemed no longer human. More terrifying than Iona's appearance was Kinu. How could Kinu be fine with all this? Inside the cell, Kinu sat by Iona. Iona smiling. Stop it. Low key. I almost was going to be like, when did you get out of jail? <laughs> okay so we got a hallway door that we haven't really checked yet so on a good note at least now mostly all of our doors are unlocked to pretty much run straight through kind of thing well you know as long as I don't run into a dead end which we all know is gonna happen <laughs> I suck at that. And we're gonna read that. What is that? I was like, dude, leave me alone. Sorry, I'm gonna go back and hide in a box for now. Okay. Okay. Okay, so if I go through the courtyard, the closest thing to me would be the counting closet. Oh, 
I hate this. she's seen me but the problem there was something that I found that I wanted to check hey <gasps> ah shit Like she knows, she knows I'm here. Right, 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 yeah. So library door is locked. Ah, this is the door that I didn't get to check. Because I don't know if the altar room is locked. Dude, I will read your shit in a minute. Hiding spot here. Okay. Okay. To hide the mulberry crest displayed on the altar, the red mulberry crest has been hidden near the shrine, while the blue mulberry crest was buried next to the stone lantern in the courtyard. Oh, okay, okay, okay. When I reported Lord Kyobe after hiding them, he bowed his head and thanked me. He looked as if a big burn has been lifted. He had a calm expression on which I had not seen in a long time. After Lady Ayano's passing, Lord Kyobe will look constantly agitated. He hardly slept. Um, always drowned himself in books and always appeared to be reading until his eyes were bloodshot. The strange historical expression left me with a sense of uneasiness. thing. Lord Kyobe has vanished without a trace. Okay, so Red Crest we already have. I'm assuming. Oh, no, 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 wait. Blue is buried... Next to the stone lantern in the courtyard, okay. Oh, this is just a gen- Maybe that could be it. Okay, so. Courtyard. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a stone lantern. Okay, we 
got that one. Near the shrine. Okay, so let's go through the courtyard and go to the counting closet room. Obviously, let's hope... It has been nearly 20 years since I left here with baby y Yui in my arms. Yui has gotten married and I have returned to the Miyama family. I announced my return and when they neither rejected nor welcomed me, Kino responded with a simple I see. Surely Kino must have resented me, even if I had abandoned her for Yui's sake. I crippled with the guilt even while living in town. I never forgot them, the sisters. I had resolved to return one day, and even at this moment I am still thinking of Ayano. Shima Shimamura committed suicide and I left the village, leaving no one in the Miami family. Kino has been Ayo's sole, Ayano's sole care caretaker. She looks after Ayana every day. Although I have returned to the household, I cannot approach Ayana, let alone touch her. I can only observe them from outside the cell. Even in her state, Ayana is always thinking about Kinu. This is my biggest regret, but I still envy Kinu even now. In my youth, I gaze upon Ayana and yearn to caress her fair skin and her silky hair. Yet in the end, I could not even touch her fingertips. Even so, I simply cannot give up. My desire to see Ayana again consumes me. Yui bears a striking resemblance to Ayano. However, she is not the same person as Ayano. In the journal of my father, Makube, which was discovered within the mansion, he talked about a cocoon. Had he found a way to bring her back? If the words written here tell the truth, then I will reclaim Ayano by any means necessary. Right, because that's not super weird. Okay, so we got a ladder. What the frick do I need a ladder for? Okay, so now... If I can get through here, get to the well, I can at least do that part. Ah, that's what you meant. Left silkworm, sil silkworm's wooden tag. A wooden key with an indented red wooden tag. It is labeled left silkworm. Okay, so I guess now we go back to the altar room.
Okay, I guess I picked a good spot to run. Okay. Green. Okay, the library key. Oh, that was a little bit easier than I than I thought there. At first I was like, dude, I'm stuck. But yeah, that wasn't too bad. Okay. Now library key is not far from where I am. I went the wrong way. 
See how good I am? I'm like, the library key is not far from where I am. And what do I do? I run in the wrong direction. I'm so good. I'm gonna read this in a minute. Oh. Saichi agitated told me he had discovered a way to cure my sister. What was this man thinking? He had once recoiled at the sight of my sister. He abandoned us and fled to town with you, Yui. I've never found Ayano to be ugly. No matter how many years past, she remains as enchanting as ever. I have kept her hair long and sleek and her lips red. I will, I was always jealous of her beauty and Salem. Iona is as beautiful as ever. Saichi is trying to separate us, but such a thing will, must not come to pass. I cannot bear it. I will not allow Saichi to take Iona away from me. That I threw my pearl hairpin into the well. I have tried to discard the thing many times, yet I can never bring myself to do it. I asked Saichi to retrieve the hairpin. He checked on the shirt. Don't worry, I'll get it for you. I embraced Saichi from behind as he peered into the well to retrieve it. I drew him closer into my soft embrace. What's the matter, Kinu? I heard a gentle voice. It's nothing, I replied. And with all my strength, I pushed him straight into the well. That was the first time and last time I touched Saichi. <gasps> wow. Okay, um. Red tag? Wooden tag? Okay, well. Um. Okay, here, here's my little bit of an issue. First thing, a long time ago. Are we close to the ending or no? And second, I don't recall seeing a spot to put these tags. Oh, unless it literally is in the silk room, room, but then I don't recall seeing an indentation for silk room. Perfect. Okay. house. Kino's room, Ayano's room, courtyard, toilet, dressing room, entrance, detached to Tommy room. Okay, save point. Draw 
dressing room. So this is not the toilet that I want. A checkered tray with old man written on it. touched it the one time so that way I'm not waste like I'm not wasting too much time Oh, cause that's not creepy at all. Okay, so we don't have any mirrors. And that takes me back here. the thing is surprisingly I'm actually doing much better at this game than I expected The sound is so creepy. Okay, 
guess I don't. Uh, oh, wait, maybe. Okay, so we did this one. Five items. Okay, wait. Let me just. Uh. I may have lost. I, I lost where the save point was. Oh, here, here. Okay, let me just save. Uh, I'm gonna make another save file. here. Kino abandoned me. Kino was crying. Kino hates me and loves Saichi. I don't want Kino to cry. I want death. I met her. She is too pure. I cry and she hugs me. She shoots threads and we form cocoons together. In the cocoon we dissolve and merge together as one. I am being lost. I stop being me. I forget many things. Her memories replace mine. She keeps eating me. I am so thirsty. Give me water. Blood red water. Who old man outside did stand there? Ayano, he cries. Who is Ayano? I think it's me. Oh man, enter cell. He strokes my head and cries. Kino laughs and said, Bon appetit. Kino, give me tasty water. She calls with a gentle voice. I I happy. Kino is precious. Save me, save me. I'm scared. I'm scared. I forget Kino. She ate almost all of me. Who am I? Where do I begin? Please no eat memories of Kino. Before I forget Kino, kill me. Okay, I was like... Am I gonna have to PvP her? Ideally, I would like to not PvP her. Ayano was constantly vomiting blood. She has has since stopped moving. She drank the blood I had pre prepped for her, knowing I had poisoned it. I had no other choice. I was sick and dying. Soon I would be sleeping with the fishes. My frail arms were withered like a dead tree branch. Just like with the chickens. Oh no, this is the only thing I could do. Once I'm gone, who will care for my sister? Who will bathe her, trim her nails, and brush her hair every day? How will society treat her? They will look at her with fear, morbid curiosity, and call her a crazy monster. She will be treated as subhuman. I cannot subject my sister to this fate. My greatest fear was forgetting my sister. My sickness grows and my memories are fading. Each night I lay down with an unbearable headache. The anxiety crushes my soul, the nagging question of if I will even remember her the next morning. I killed everyone. My father, Saichi, Yui, uh, Yu, yeah, Yui, and even my sister. I was left alone with a noose. I am dying in pain. I apologize. 
I know how my sister really felt, but I treated her poorly out of envy, despite knowing how vile it was. I admired everything about her. This is why I despised her. My sister was the only one who truly understood me, despite knowing how cruel and merciless I could be, yet still Ayano cared for me more than anyone else. When the sun said she would light up the house for me, she did so to, to prevent me from falling. My eyes and legs were, are old and weak. She would always gently massage my wrinkled, cold hands. Her mind is almost completely void of memories, yet she, will, she never forgot about me. That is enough. We found happiness in our own way. We knew all things come to an end. Forgive me, as this is the only way to save my sister. I do not know what happened to her on that day. I do not know who the she she writes about is, but I like her. I also wish to dissolve in a cocoon and become one with my sister. Yeah, I gotta kind of get her to, like... Slash slash jump. One year later.
one of four. あなたを許すことはできないけれどもそれでもあなたを許すことはできないけれどもそれでもあなたを許すことはできないけれどもそれでもあなたを許すことはできないけれどもそれでもあなたを許すことはできないけれどもそれでもあなたを許すことはできない
Like, I can't show all four, but I can at least show two. Oh, I missed. files, but I'm still proud of we got almost all the files too. chance to get a good fix good face oops I think I was too slow <laughs> so we decide to what stay here to protect her I'm dropping out of college Dr. <laughs> I don't think I can finish this game on nightmare mode though <laughs> ah, so he decides to stay. <laughs> That's what he said. Oh. Was it feeding time? Oh, poor chicken. Ah. So he becomes her caretaker. Oh, 
丈夫何の心配もいらないさこれからは俺がばあちゃんとずっと一緒にいるんだから Look at right now, it's like, I'm hungry! <laughs> it's like, me too, me too, just wait, we're almost done. <laughs> the story is sad. Like, when you think about, like, everything that, like, happened to that, like, that whole family. Though, like, I do wonder what happened to her in the mountain that day to, to, for her to become like that. I deserve a high five. We finished this way faster than I thought. Like, I, I'm proud of myself. Go me. Clap, clap, high five, all the, all the things. Go me! <laughs> Descendant of a xenomorph ending. She's a xenomorph? Interesting. Um, so, yeah. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. 